this bill is modeled directly after the legislation passed in Texas last year. Abortions, since that bill has been passed, has dropped 60% in Texas um, since that bill was passed. While the Texas law prohibits abortion, once medical professionals can detect cardiac activity, usually around six weeks, the Tennessee language proposes to prohibit all abortion. Courts have blocked other states from imposing similar restrictions, but this law differs significantly because it leaves enforcement up to private citizens through civil lawsuits instead of criminal prosecutors. The Texas Supreme Court recently upheld this bill, ensuring this bill remains in the Texas law for the unforeseeable future. So um, you could have um, a rapist, one in five, maybe one in six women in Tennessee are victims of, of rape. And you could have a rapist and uh, that rapist could impregnate a young lady, a minor, and uh, the rapist's mother or father could bring suit against that minor uh, if they decided to get an abortion, if this passes? Representative. The bill states that a rapist, sexual assault, or incest cannot bring a charge against the woman that has harmed. So, Representative Freeman. That wasn't the question I asked. I'm sorry. I asked if their parent, sibling, friend, neighbor, spouse could bring suit against the minor who was raped to force them to pay a $10,000 fine if they uh, decide to have an abortion. Representative. Can we go out of session for legal to specify that? Um, any objections? We'll go out of session. Uh, Representative Freeman. I, I would appreciate the, the sponsor's opinion. Mm. Uh, but would, would you have an opinion? My assumption is that they could because it's any citizen. So yes. Other I, than the rapist. I don't, I don't need to go out of session. Okay. I think that's, that's actually, I okay. think, the correct answer. Okay. okay. 